Good morning and welcome to the Weekly Insights with John Plassard. Today, I'm focusing on the European market. Market expectation for European growth and the Eurostock 600 should improve over the next few months on the back of six items. First of all, faster vaccinations and falling COVID-19 hospitalizations. The pace of vaccinations has stepped up notably in Europe. Following a slow start to the vaccine rollout and a deceleration in mid-March as the AstraZeneca vaccine was temporarily put on hold, daily vaccinations have accelerated significantly over the last two weeks, running at around 1 million doses in the EMU4 economies. The vaccine supply should increase sharply in Q2 with the number of available treatments per month more than quadrupling between March and June. The euro area could be on track to vaccinate 50% of its population with the first dose in early July. Second point, higher durable spending. Unlike in 2008-2009, durable, durable spending has been significantly softer in the Eurozone than in the US in the last year and should rebound with greater vengeance. This may not compensate for the fiscal divergence, but it could keep the growth gap narrower than the market expect. As a result, the level of euro area a real GDP could exceed its pre-pandemic level at the end of this year, roughly two quarters ahead of Bloomberg consensus. Third point, equity flow have lagged for Europe still in favor of US market. Fourth, European valuation remains well below the US even on an equivalent sector basis. Fifth, Dividend yields have held up despite the fall in bond yields. Six, we expect a lower euro in the coming months. That could also be a driver for the European market. In brief, we think the combination of rising European, uh, euro area growth expectation, solid equity returns for the region, initial normalization signal, from the ECB will extend the recent turn higher in the Eurostox 60. Finally, in terms of themes, we like the reflation trade and expect the sector related with the Green Deal to largely outperform in the second part of this year. Thank you very much. Have a great week. Stay safe, read my morning, and keep on winning.